going to college to play soccer at the next level is already a great achievement. But Mackenzie is the first student, boy or girl, from Joe T. Robinson High to commit to play Division I soccer. It's crazy to think that not even a week ago, Jacksonville fans were ready to take their seats to watch the Titans play West Memphis in the state title game. Thanks to the coronavirus, schools are being shut down. People have to stay at least six feet away from each other. And we don't know when sports are going to resume again. Yeah, Coach Joyner is obviously disappointed, but he thinks it's better to be safe than sorry. If there's any hope for baseball in 2020, it's going to have to start with the majors. Then after that, Allen said that they can get started on a minor league season. But for the Arkansas Travelers, the clock is ticking. Jackson works out about two hours a day, doing crazy workouts like pushing cars. Troy, do you mean to stop accelerating now? No, 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 just keep going, Nick. Coach Salty has been a Conway guy from the beginning. He played high school ball here, collegiate ball around the area. He won a state title with the Wampus Cats in 2010 when he was an assistant coach, but now he has the opportunity to bring Conway a state championship as the leader of the program. Brian and JD were the 45th and 46th hole-in-one on this hole since 2010. Now, that might make it sound less impressive. However, back-to-back holes-in-ones on back-to-back -back swings, those odds are 17 million to one. Everybody's working from home and from what general manager Paul Allen has told me, they know just as much as we do regarding the future and that's close to nothing. Hey, were you about to watch another Harry Potter marathon? No. <laughs> Star Wars. Okay, would you rather do something fun and outside instead? Yes, this whole quarantine thing is killing me. Well, I think I know just the place. Come on, change the channel, let's go. All right. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Troy's Terrific Travels. You know, the last one was so much fun. We had to do another one. So today we're heading over to Lake Catherine State Park to check out Falls Branch Trail. Come on, get in the car. Let's go. As soon as the lights turned on, that's when the party started. Right behind me is where the parade is happening and everybody's honking, playing music, and Little Rock Central is showing their senior athletes a lot of love. With college baseball ending early, universities are recommending that their student athletes just go home. The silver lining for the Little Rock Trojans is that they only have five seniors on their 2020 roster. With no other sports going on, fishing's actually the perfect activity for social distancing. In order to keep everybody safe and sanitary during the reopening of gyms, Jeff says he's got workers that are constantly power cleaning all the equipment after each use. 